What's up guys, welcome to a new video and uh, welcome to Hawaii. So right now I'm on vacation with my family, but I also just got the Samsung Galaxy S20 5G. Now this is the cloud blue and it is actually one of my favorite colors, if you can't tell. Now I do have the S20 Ultra, which I've had an amazing time with so far, but I am curious to see what the S20 can do. And a lot of you guys have been asking. We're gonna be doing an unboxing and trying it out here. Um, this is gonna be my first ever standing unboxing outside. Um, it was way too beautiful to do this inside, so we're just gonna see what happens. I've already cut the tape so that it goes smoothly. But be very careful. <gasps> Hello. Hi. It kind of blends in with the sky. Oh my gosh, it is absolutely beautiful. This is so small compared to the Ultra. I've been carrying around the Ultra and like holding this. Definitely has a little bit more of a natural feel in my hand. So this has the 6.2 inch AMOLED display compared to the 6.9 inch, which is the Ultra. Still has the hole punch camera, triple camera system here in the back. We have a 10 megapixel selfie camera, 12 megapixel ultra wide, 12 megapixel wide angle, as well as the 64 megapixel telephoto. So I just wanna look at it all day. So here is the size compared to the S20 Ultra with just the regular S20. One of my favorite things about shooting outside is noise. Oh, that's FedEx. They're our friends. Um, it got really sunny. Oh my gosh, and now it's not sunny and I moved and now it's cloudy. Whatever. We have the super fast charger. This is a 25 watt fast charger. The S20 has the 4,000 milliamp hour battery. We have the very, very, very important SIM card ejector, AKG headphones, and we have the USB-C to USB-C charging cable. Let's get this bad boy fired up, shall we? So right now I'm just going to set this up and go about testing a phone as I would any other phone by using it. So I'm filming the rest, this is the front facing camera 4K. Uh, the audio is directly from this Samsung S20. It is so windy outside right now. But so far I have to say that I'm actually very impressed. I'm having a really great time with this phone as well. The 30 times zoom is something really cool to have. So is the 100 times zoom. It's just really not necessary. I did take a lot of pictures and videos and the quality was really good. And I know a lot of people are gonna be like, okay, but how was the quality compared to so-and-so? So I'm gonna show you guys some raw pictures that I shot straight from this camera as well as them compared to the S20 Ultra and the iPhone 11 Pro Max. So, let's go. Now we're testing out the front facing camera. Hi. Okay. Hit so, pause, see what happens. Yes, I was just saying, like, I like that you can pause the video, ready? <gasps> Okay, and now wow, we have picked up. We've picked up our, our recording. It's nice That's because it cool. all just goes into one, you know, video clip instead of having 5,000 of, you know, whatever. How are you enjoying the phone? I'm, I'm loving the size. Honestly, I love the flip so much. It's just so cool. But I think, honestly, this being their lower end model, I'm really impressed. It's pretty cool. I, I'm excited to, uh, to compare our pictures later. So right now I'm hanging at this place called the China Walls. It's really cool. People do a lot of cliff diving down here. Oh, we got a big wave coming, people. Big wave. Okay. Whoa. There's a bunch of people snorkeling and cliff diving. I'm just observing and testing out the front-facing uh, 4K video camera quality right now. I will not be getting in the water because I've got too much technology on me. Now another thing, the 8K does crop. And my friend Farouk did a really great example showing the 8K versus the 4K crop. So I'm gonna give you guys a little demonstration of that as well. 8K vlogging with the Samsung. It took me four days to get the content off of my phone, to edit, to render, to upload. So 8K vlogging is not gonna be for me, but I know a lot of people wanna see the crop. So here's an example of the 8K versus the 4K crop. All right, so here we have an example of the 4K without the crop. 
And here we have the 8K crop. Now my sister Justine has the pink S20, which is the same exact phone. And I challenged her earlier to see if she could take a better photo than me. So I'm gonna have to get her and we're gonna have to compare photos. And you guys are gonna be the judge of it because I'm pretty sure I took a way better photo, but um, you guys are gonna be the judge of that. Once I can find her, we're gonna talk about it. Okay, I have tracked down my sister Justine. It was really hard to track me down. I'm in the room right next to her. So I'm still filming on the S20, so I have link shared everything to my S20 Ultra. I was gonna film with this, but I wanted to keep it consistent. So I have my pictures on here, which you guys will be seeing on the screen. Let's start by what was your favorite picture that you took? Mine was actually, okay, so other than the dog, which I think we both took pictures of, was this night shot I took. Whoa. I know. When did you do that? Um, I was standing on the side of the highway when you guys left me. Is this edited? No, I did nothing to it. I mean, mm. other than Samsung adding its, its little whatever filters. it does to it. But this oh. is it. I took the picture. Okay, so this is my favorite picture. It actually happened today. Oh, that's really freaking nice. I didn't have a chance to take any night shots yet, um, but this is probably my favorite picture. This is the ultra wide. I said in my video, it's so unfair because doesn't matter what you take a picture with in Hawaii, like everything is so beautiful. Someone's like, is this, do I have like Hawaii to thank for this or the Samsung? I was like, I don't know. I don't know, because it looks really, really it looks good. Did you take any selfies? I did, I have one favorite okay. selfie. Should let's we do see, a favorite selfie? Let's see what type of, oh, a favorite selfie. Oh shoot, mine's on the other phone. Well, one of my favorite selfies I actually already put in this video and it was this one. That's really nice. You didn't even see it. No, I didn't. But this was the second selfie. Well, let me show you my favorite selfie. That's Thank a good you. one. Looks like you're touching it. Yeah, that's, that was the point. That's pretty good. Have you taken any live focus pictures? I did. I took one of this doggy. <gasps> Look at this doggy. Oh my God. I know. I okay, know. well this was one I took of you, which also looks really good, but for some reason I'm really just enjoying the dog. This is really great. I like the dog better. Well, they're I, gonna see it on the screen. They're gonna see it. This is one of the 64 megapixel shots that I took. It's very Pretty crisp. crispy. It's probably my favorite out of, for the 64 megapixel. That, that's mega actually the only one I took. But wait, I didn't get to show them my really great 30X photo. Oh, I didn't even put mine on here because it was trash content. Look, look at this. This is a whale. Is that that rock? No, oh, that's a whale. That's not a whale. Oh, uh, yeah, it is. Look, it's moving. Okay, look, that's a whale. There's a couple whales. Look, there's a, ta a whale tail. That is a whale tail. Uh, here's the thing, 30 times zoom is great to have, but the quality isn't that great. Okay, so who do you think took some better pictures from the S20 photo challenge that we kind of just had? Your rainbow picture is really good. And so is this one. This one? That's good too. From the cave? But look at this from one. I got a nice sunset photo as well. a pretty good one. What's your favorite feature about the S20 lineup? I love the single take feature. Me too. It's really fun. Like I got a couple really cool, fun little things. I got this one little like boomerang type of thing, which was like this crab going back and forth. Single take is a fun feature. It is on all of the S20 phones. And I've just been having a good time. The displays on the Samsung phones are incredible. It's even on the flip too, if you update the firmware. Oh, there you go. All right. I well, love it. It's a really cool feature. It's a cool feature. Well, thank you, Justine. Make sure you go check out her video. And um, yeah, I'm gonna go enjoy my vacation. Actually, I'm gonna finish editing this and then go enjoy my vacation. So stay tuned for some more videos and I'll see you again soon. Bye.